Okay, so here is the lab directions. Here is the lab write-up that needs to be turned in. This is the coffee cup calorimeter and it's designed to keep heat in. This is the thermometer that will record the temperature. We have NaOH and HCl. I'm going to read for 50 milliliters of hydrochloric acid. and 50 milliliters of sodium hydroxide. I'm going to accurately find the volume, reading at the bottom of the meniscus. I've measured of the HCl 49.5 milliliters of HCl. And of the NaOH, I'm a little bit better. I'm going to call that 50.0 of the NaOH. Now I'm going to take the temperature of each one by putting it in the thermometer, the thermometer in the graduated cylinder and wait until the thermometer doesn't move anymore. The NaOH has a temperature of 21.8 degrees C. I will record that. I will get the NaOH off of the thermometer by rinsing it with water. And I'll dry it. Now I'll take the temperature of the HCl. HCl has a temperature of 22, no, 21.1 degrees. I'm going to take this out, rinse it off with water. I haven't seen him for three days. Nope. I was supposed to have him I know, isn't that frustrating? Sorry. I, I don't even know where to point you. Now, I'm going to put the HCL into the calorimeter. And then I'm going to get ready to put the NaOH into it. I want to capture all the heat of this reaction. So I put the top on as quickly as I can. Put the thermometer in and stir it around and wait for the highest temperature. The temperature is 
six. And that will be my final temperature. I need to average these two to get my initial temperature and the average um, would be these two added together and divided by two. It will go right here. And then uh, the volume would be these two added together. Okay, that's it.